Yes, I have my hands raised. Do you know why? Because I'm a fan of Tia Hell. I'm a fan of Tia Hell. I was a fan of Tia Hell before you even knew her. Yes, I was a fan of that energetic girl that was really screaming and being hyped. And at some point she was the NXT Championship contender. She almost got Tiffany Stratton by Kamura. I was a fan of that girl from day one, honestly. Whenever she was showcased in Chase U University and she was having a roommate by one of the Chase U guys that is not now not working in the company, I was a fan. I, I really liked this girl. And whenever, whenever she lost the championship match against Tiffany Stratton and whenever... JC Jane approached her, I knew that some shit is about to start smelling here, if you know what I mean. We saw the downfall of Tia Hale by she teaming up with JC Jane. And I'm not sure if this was actually the whole point and we did the JC Jane thing in order to destroy the JC thing, JC Jane thing, but I'm happier than ever right now. Tia Hell is back. The old Tia Hell, the Chase You Tia Hell, the way that Tia Hell was dressed back was way better. Whenever she was with JC Jane, she was a little bit like a slut. I'm sorry, Tia Hell. I, I gotta say it. It's just leather clothes are not working really and Maybe they're not working with you, but I'm not a fan of leather clothes in general. So please forgive me for saying this bad word, but it was looking pretty bad. Also, Nathan Fraser, do not beat me. I know that you're the legit girlfriend of the hell. I know that I said girlfriend. Maybe I want to start to beef with you, <laughs> you know? So the direction right now for the hell, you're probably asking, is unknown. Actually, it's pretty known. She's gonna have probably a feud with JC Jane and she's gonna smash her head in. And I really want after that Tia Hell to go for the championship again and to bring Chase U to new heights. Because honestly, JC Jane is kind of right. Chase U are losers, but Tia Hell is not a loser. And I feel like Tia Hell is actually the chance of Chase U to bring championship. To the table and honestly this whole storyline of chase you bankrupting and after that jc jane helping what's gonna happen now when jc jane is not gonna be part of chase you where the money will come from and also someone needs to win a championship in order to sponsor that university boys and girls think about it so tia hell must be the girl you know uh, maybe after Roxanne Perez fails slash succeeds beating Valkyria. After that, Tia Hell is going to take the championship. And I'm really hyped to see Tia Hell winning the championship. And I really want to see that energetic furball of a human being to be with the championship and scream and make the Batista thing with the ropes. But she's not that strong enough and it looks like a little hamster is playing with the ropes and I love it, you know? So just to sum it up, thank you so much for bringing back the old Tia Hell. Welcome back Tia Hell. And thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time. Peace.